Hello, guys. So the Armand's Summon Rush, or sorry, the Summon Rush for the Armand's, you know, Titan Points is here. I just wanted to quickly make a video, not just doing my summons, but I wanted to warn you guys, right? I know we've already had two summoning events, again, this being the second. There's probably a champion chase still. A lot of people are suspecting this because the event runs to April 3rd, guys. There's probably still a champion chase tournament coming up, right? So I just wanted to warn everyone. Look what the, they're doing at the the last milestone of points. It's 150. Now remember, you can only miss 250. So if they do a similar champion chase where the last milestone is really high and it's 150 points, if you don't do either this or that champion chase maxed, you cannot miss both, right? You cannot miss both last milestones. You can't go medium way to the summon rush and medium way to the champion chase. You will miss 300 points and not get the five star soul. So I just wanted to warn you guys, most people are suspecting another summon event. This is not supposed to be easy to get this Armand soul. So I just wanted to warn you guys, if you're gonna do this, you, you probably need to max this event. You probably need to max this event and it's a summon rush. So, you know, if you have the resources, you can guarantee know what you're gonna get. But the champion chase for most people ends up being 90% easier. If you've been saving, you know, if you've been saving fusions and you can fuse like Kira or Tatsu, if you have extra broad maws, which I can, I can make like four broad maws, I believe. Um, if you have extra stuff like this, you can get points to that. You can do remnants. You can do fragment someone from fragment collector champions. Uh, obviously, Armands wouldn't be in your uh, repertoire because he had to get pulled. Um, but just be wary of that, right? You can't do halfway on the Sun Rush and then the Champion Chase. You're probably going to miss the soul. So you need to max one or the other at the very least. And then still invest in the other, most likely. It's it's really tough. They're really trying to make this hard. I mean, it's understandable. <clears throat> Five-star souls are very rare, especially for a champion as powerful as Zarman's. So I'm definitely going for it. I'm just really stuck. I don't know. What, let me know what you guys think in the comments. What What would you do? Would you, if you have the resources, you know, with how powerful a resource the five star soul for Armands is, would you just do the summon rush, make sure you can do it? Or would you like hold out resources, be really care careful saving stuff and then do the, uh, do the champion chase, which is probably going to be really bloated in points to be honest. But you know, if I fuse four broad maws, right? If I fuse four broad maws, um, that's 1400 points in champion chase. And you probably have to go to like 3,500 to 4,000 or something for the top. I think that's so doable. At the very least, I do have to summon some shards. And I'm going to go for Siffy because uh, it's Siffy. Uh, so I, I'm going to start pulling some shards while I continue to talk and think. But um, I'm going to at least do the minimum. Oh, Void Epic. Nice. Another Wergren. Uh, I'm at least going to do the minimum amount to get that 1,000 points. And I want to do it while going for Siffy, because obviously Siffy. Um, four is going to be 480 points. I need 1,000. Five is 600. Seven is 800 or 720. Oh. Man, this is really... It's a lot to consider, isn't it? It's a lot to consider how we should handle this, knowing how Plarium is. Mm. I'm not going to be summoning too many more, so I'm just going to quickly get this out of the way. Yeah, I just wanted to warn you guys, just be careful. They're definitely being tricky. I don't have that many voids anyway, so... I think it's definitely wise to just go for the minimum. So what are we at now? Is this seven, I think? Let me check my points. If I if I stop here though, <laughs> the thing is, if I stop here, I have to literally not miss any more points. And I am very, very active. I've been very actively playing. I'm playing a lot because I've really been enjoying the um I've really been enjoying Curse City. So I've been very active in the game. Okay, so I think we're going to stop for now. <laughs> so we could just do the rest with... I'll just do one Ancient. Uh, I'm not even going to put any of these champions on here. Um, 
but I think that's fine. I think, you know, with my, with my remnant, with my broad maw plan, I think I go very light. Cause the, and the thing is, the only thing I really want from this event is Siffy. And I only have eight more chances at her and it's probably astronomically low. It's, it's the same as my luck is going to be. I don't think I'm going to push it. It is my most wanted champion, but she'll be on a progressive chance again, most likely at some point. There'll be another event for her and I'll have more shards. But uh, I just think it's... I think it's just the best for me. I could commit a little more and then be able to skip other events, but I'm just gonna do Dungeon Divers. I'm just gonna max it out with a thousand gems or whatever it takes, it's fine on me. I have tons. Artifact Enhancement, I'm blasting through these. I have millions and millions of silver all the time. Um, just because I don't have a lot of gear to build anymore. I'm, it's, it's a, I'm at a different point in the game, being end game. I get a lot of silver income because I'm always farming dungeons. I almost never farm campaign. Uh, and I'm not keeping a lot of gear. I'm selling a lot, which gives me a lot more silver income. And I'm not building a lot of new pieces of gear. I, lot, I quite frequently at the point I'm at in the game, I'm just moving gear around, um, which is still expensive, but it's not as expensive as, you know, building six new uh, pieces of gear, maxing out stuff from scratch. Let me know what you guys think. I still obviously have time. Uh, I will definitely upload this video as is. Uh, I still obviously have time to um, to change my plan of attack. I still obviously have time to do it because I've just lightly committed for now. Uh, and so I can definitely still um, go pull more shards. I mean, I haven't gotten rid of them, so I can definitely still do that. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed and will continue to follow along, join the community, subscribe, and, and be part of the future videos. I just wanted to quickly share uh, where I find content, where I find joy, where I find hope in these crazy times we live in, so much going on in the world, so much bad news, and so many just things to bring you down. And I just wanted to share that I'm a Christian and I fully believe as silly as it may sound to some people, that there is a God that made us all with purpose. And although we all chose to go our own way, myself included, and, and, and to just reject this God, reject this creator, that that broke his heart, that he didn't want us to be separated, and that he sent Jesus to die for our sins and to make us new, to make a way for us to be reconciled as a payment for our sin as a payment for the punishment that we deserve that jesus died and now we can be reconciled to god and not only can we be made right with god and have the promise of heaven but this this life is also filled with purpose as we're able to know him and find joy and contentment through the through the relationship with god that we can invite others and we can make a lasting eternal impact on others by sharing this truth and inviting them to know him and i would just love to tell you guys more if you have any questions but i just want you to know that god loves you whoever you are whatever you've done nothing has disqualified you from his love that he genuinely cares for you more than you would ever know and i've experienced that love and it is just it's it's done so much for me in my life and i want that to happen for you guys so uh thank you guys so much let me know if you have any questions i hope you guys are here and going to join the community no matter what you think or who you are or what you believe guys god loves you i love you god bless guys